The traffic mod allows you to succeed faster in everything relating traffic. In game you can find it in the top left corner with this traffic cone icon. And you have the choice between two tools, let's start with the lane connector tool. You begin by selecting an intersection and here you can see all these nodes which show you where cars on different lanes can go. If you are unsure and you already did some stuff here, you can always press reset to vanilla. In this case it stays the same. Or another quick function could be remove U-turns. It highlights red what it will affect. So cars cannot turn around here. And I clicked it and you see it disappears now. Now cars won't make U-turns here holding up traffic. And another quick option you can take is remove unsafe. If you don't want to do anything custom, this is probably a good choice to do if you have an intersection that has a lot of traffic jams. It just removes all the paths that take a long time to do. So after doing this, if cars come from here, they can continue go straight or go right. So just the easy paths. Another thing you can do, and for that I'm going to pause the game, is you can remove all connection. You can now see that the game is complaining about it. But this allows you to draw all the connections you want to have in custom. You press the node you want to create a line from. You press the node you want to go to. You click it and then you can click other nodes where else people are allowed to go. Right click to delete. And in this case, so here we have a highway exit that is for small towns. So it's not a crazy exit. And we always have traffic jam problems in the back because people are really merging into this one lane. So I'm trying to fix it by only allowing these lane changes. If you come from the other side, you're only allowed to go straight through the intersection. And if you want to exit the city from this one way street, you're only allowed to take a right turn. This could be a really, really simple setup for this intersection. To prevent this like early lane changing, you can go to the street that is affected. And here of course also remove U-turns and make sure that all these lines are straight. And after making any change, you should probably speed up the time and take a look at how it is going. Now we can see all the cars are jamming up here because they all want to go on the left lane. This is something the mod could fix as well. But in general, the traffic is already flowing better with this new intersection design. Taking a look at another part of the city, we're going to check out the priority tools, which is the other one in the top left corner. You can simply select it and then again select an intersection. Now you have all the incoming lanes selected and there are options where they can go. In this case, I want this top of the T intersection being the priority street. So I will put a yield sign clicking here. It will now turn orange. And these streets will have priority. They are now green, resulting here now in this car stopping while the others can go. Of course, there are pedestrians in the way as well, but this should make the traffic flow on this T intersection way better than this bottom street. I did this because there are buses like here driving across this street and they shouldn't wait too long. You can do these things at many intersections, sadly not yet at roundabouts. These are not supported yet, but will probably come soon. These are the basic tools of the lane connector mod. Let me know if you want to see more of it or you have any questions. Happy gaming.